What it do, what it do. So today's video is all about she is thinking about you. So when it comes to you, with space that is given with this woman, she is over here feeling like, why are you giving me more? And then on top of that, she's thinking that maybe you don't like the fact that you're giving her this much space and that you're going to break the space and you don't do that. And so a lot of times she gets there thinking about you, wondering about you, making assumptions and all types of things. So before I really get into the details, fellas, make sure you give this video a huge thumbs up and don't forget we got consultations available we could talk about anything consultations could be fun we could talk about other ways that you could get her to miss you after this video make sure you do check out that link and it starts at 15 minutes goes all the way until an hour and there is bundle deals available now fellas let's right let's right let's right get into it like, like let's get straight right into the details of how this girl has been feeling all types of ways and maybe hasn't shown you so first things first when you start giving this whole space and this is what you're going to be doing to get her to miss you remember you're supposed to be an alpha guy a busy guy you're going to be doing your stuff worry about you right so when you give her the space and let's say you're doing it in ways where it's ignoring or no contact we talk about ghosting here and there and stuff right so when you give her that space she's gonna be missing you knowing that you're gonna probably end up hitting her later but you see, the longer that you go ahead, and this is my fellas that are, are over here making sure that they're busy, making sure that they're applying full pressure of not speaking to her. So when you're over here distracted with your own life and she's getting to the missing you so much and wanting you back, what she's peeping is that you're moving on. So sometimes some females really believe that you'll never get over them, okay? But really, your actions is what's going to be speaking so loud. So obviously, when she's really seeing that you don't care, that's how you can start viewing it. When she starts seeing that on your side, the distance is put into place, fellas. You're making sure that you're not talking to her if you don't need to. When she's pulling back, you pull back. And now I'm going to maybe talk more about how you're supposed to not be talking to her. She's disrespectful. Um, communication, cutting it off in a second. But I just want this to be about... If you're just having this girl miss you and want to hit you up and see you tonight or something like that. So for one example, again, it could be you guys been talking for a little bit and then she's noticing all day you went without talking to her. Fellas, remember when you are trying to get her to think about you, miss you, want you, all types of stuff, you got to put space. You got to put basically things into place that is causing y'all to be away from her. So that's going to make her want attention. That's going to make her want you to look her way. And fellas, if you want to know what she likes you to do and other things in the bedroom, it's all on Patreon. I got a whole lot, a whole lot of mean, a whole lot. You won't see on here videos that, you know, we talk about everything. We talk about the good Things girls likes and we also get into how reaction videos really mm -hmm. yep we talk about that and we get into how things be going on uh-huh all on patreon <laughs> all right so i try to tell y'all you know in a way where y'all need to know patreon has those videos but back to how oh now she's getting that oh on your part you don't want to give her attention you don't have that oh well i'm chasing you vibe no more or i'm gonna be texting you trying to figure out what you're doing so when she starts thinking about you a lot of times it starts with her thinking of why things are the way it is so for example why are you going the whole day without speaking to her? So right back to like, let's say you were at work all day. And then at the end of the night, right? And remember, she's been pre, maybe that you've been at work. Um, she's been knowing that, you know, you're just busy guy. So she's thinking in between, maybe your typical type of self is um, going to message her. So she's thinking in between midday, you're going to want to say something to her. But this is how you start changing things. You go on with your day and you stay distracted. So now when females are starting to feel like, well, you know, I'm thinking about him. He should be thinking about me. Oh, he's going to hit me up soon. That's out of the picture. So this is how a female has you on her mind all the time. <laughs> This is how she can't stop thinking about you because she's thinking, here's how it really goes. When are you going to text her? So when it's like that whole day getting closer to the end of the day, right? Let's say it's the end of the night. Your shift is done, right? And let's say it's about like 1130, whatever. Some, some couples like to talk at night, whatever the case may be. What she was still expecting was that, oh, well, you know, how's your day going? Now, that's just examples with texting. Just imagine with Snapchat or whatever social media platforms you use. Imagine when you're on there and not messaging her. Fellas, do y'all start thinking about how you have that happen to you? And you're the one that's over here thinking about her like crazy? 
Like, no, like, think about it backwards right now for a second, fellas. When, oh, well, you you can basically have her go all day without talking to you. She doesn't feel the need to say, how's your days going? How's this and all that types of stuff, right? When it's like that, and then you're over here watching her post something. Yes, and what you're feeling inside is, oh, I can't even get a text back? And that is just really the truth. Like, a lot of times, it's so bad where y'all should have been doing no contact. She should have been cutting her off so she could over here uh, not be disrespectful or not text you back when, you know, you guys have a thing going on or you guys are actually together. You get me? But let's just talk right back on to how, oh, things, when they're the other way, she doesn't like that. When, oh, you don't want to talk to her now and you don't need to do the checking up or wanting to say something, especially when it was already in your character or let's say in your routine, it was kind of like what you like to do. You made it to be like that with her. When it's now like that, fellas, what do you do to her? You now have her see somebody else, right? That viewpoint that, oh, well, this guy is always going to be texting me all the time, always going to be wanting to see me. And fellas, something I won't really be talking about so much, but keep in mind, she's also thinking about you a lot as you're improving, right? We didn't talk about how maybe you're transforming, like, for real, for real. That's a whole nother topic, whole nother video. But, like, let's talk about, once again, she might be posting, right? And then she's noticing that you're posting and she didn't text you. This is a whole nother different example now. She didn't text you bad. But she's seeing that you're good and you don't feel the need to say anything to her. You go on the next day. Sometimes just playing it off like you didn't care, um, you never cared about it, like her not wanting to say something, but watch your story. Sometimes playing that off too is also going to affect that woman, right? It might make her feel like, oh, oh, you don't really care. But really what you're doing is playing it smart because you have a woman not play these games of, well, oh, I guess I could text you later on. Right? So oftentimes, like, y'all got to stop letting them do what they want to do. First off, with just texting you freely, uh, making plans freely. I didn't even talk about rescheduling. Y'all, I've been talking about rescheduling, but y'all know that's one common thing. So just with that, y'all got to see how much, how much can she take you more serious if you could, as a fella, do less if that's the case. Give her less if that's the case. Because once more... What are you trying to do? You're trying to have her want that attention from you, right? Basically, why this whole time has she not wanted that attention? She's probably been getting it from you, right? Females start feeling like when you're looking the other way and now it's happening for so long, too long. Oh, what's going on? What's up? But also, this is what makes them more attracted to you. More looking at you feeling like I'm into you. I want to get to know you. But really, it's obviously a nice, lovely thing because she's obviously appreciating the time that you'll give to her now you get you get the difference before y'all would just freely give her any time y'all just make it so easy right if that's the other way of like let's say just hitting her up right why do you gotta do that why do you even gotta do that after she's giving you a lot of reasons not to do it so let's just wrap up with saying if you're gonna have her basically uh, miss you think about you want you back She's going to want whatever it is that maybe you've taken away in that moment. She's going to want maybe to have it easier for herself. She's going to also maybe get into missing you. But, fellas, you guys you guys got to get that it's starting once again with you making sure that you're doing the things that you didn't need to do this whole entire time, if that is the case. So, really, if it's important for you to be not watching your story, this is something I didn't say, but I, you know, I kind of said the whole story thing, if she's watching yours, da 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 If it's important for you not to be watching her story, Story, so you're showing that I'm not thinking, I'm not watching, I'm not, you know, I'm not even pre, I'm not even wanting to tap on it, right? Of course, like if it's uh, Snapchat, you can see the little story, but validation comes from, of course, her seeing your name when you click on it. So some of y'all just don't even care. You'll still let her see that. But that's just being one example, right? With social media, if you are trying to get the message across that, hey, I'm busy, I'm distracted. Oh, I'll watch your story later. Especially when she's, you know, posting something that you like, something pretty, something cute. And you want to be like, oh, what is she doing? And fellas, I didn't even talk about how sometimes they'll post things. Oh yeah, because they want you to click. Yes, 
that's a whole nother story when she starts missing you. And fellas, if you want to get your mind right, y'all know affirmations is available and affirmations is very much important. You can repeat after affirmations, but you let this affirmation play while you're sleeping and it works while you're sleeping in your mind. It boosts your confidence and it remembers, it reminds you. Yeah, it remembers all the good things about you because it's telling you, but it's going to remind you every day when you're maybe feeling down. It's going to remind you that you're a better person. It's going to uplift you and make you believe in who you truly are. Are. And if it's a man that you are, believe that. Okay, so it's the self doubt. Let's get that out of the picture. Let's get that out of the way. But affirmation is going to definitely save the day. Let's say it like that. Save your night, play it at night. And you could also play it in the morning if that's the case as well. All right, right back into oh, now she's thinking, feeling ways about you because you're gone and now you got her missing you. I'm going to give you guys that Snapchat example so we can, you know, finish the video strong or whatever. But I'm talking about how. She's posting things. I, we'll talk about it in a different video as well. Um, but let's just talk about it right now of how she's posting things because she wants your attention. She's posting things because she knows at the end, oh, guess what? You're going to click. Now, this is right back into she's probably missing you. That's why she went and did it. In the process of posting that, guess what she was thinking? Oh, he's going to like this. Oh, he's going to think about this. Oh, he's going to want to see me, right? Now, once again, we know that, oh, yeah, females do love the attention and stuff, if it's from you or from that other guy or whatever the case may be. But really what she's doing in that case when it's specific to you, she's going to once more make sure it's something that's going to make you want to click. So reacting will be you going ahead, giving that validation by clicking. So it could be also something that's so mysterious or something that's like kind of unknown, right? This is some of the stuff that y'all could maybe be doing on your part. Maybe y'all got to stop posting other things or start posting this. That's a whole nother story. But for you, when you're watching her story, you see her little highlight. What you see there is something that's like not obvious. Something that might also raise a red flag. Something that's giving you where you at, right? Sometimes you can have a female post somewhere where it's like just so random. Somewhere where it's like, oh, like you've never been there before. Or really, where are you at? So all of that is just to get you at the end to click. And that's where, okay, you know, she's missing you once more. But those are the times, those are the signs you cannot miss. You can't let her, you know, make you fall into the traps of like, well, you know, I want to see you. It's the same thing when, um, and I say want to see you without telling you I I want to see you. If she misses you, she got to tell you and then come and see you and all that. But it's the same thing when she goes ahead and sends you a cute picture directly. Let's say it's not that she has to do Snapchat and she does it when she wants to see you after she's missing you, when she's thinking about you, right? When, oh, in the moment, she's just like, oh, how about I just send this to him or you know what? Who's on my mind? Right? Or maybe she wants to just pop up and sneak back into your life. And this is the way it's going to happen. But once again, she's thinking about you. She's definitely thinking about you. And like I just said, might be missing you, wanting to see you. All right, fellas. So that is it for this video. Definitely have so much more to talk about. I will talk more about it in my next video. I'm going to have another video just like this. We'll talk about the other stuff like Snapchat, right? There are so many other ways that they be trying to get y'all to see them when they're missing you and wanting y'all to look their way. But fellas, don't forget about consultations. It is available. We could talk about anything. And Patreon, a whole lot of videos y'all will never, ever see on here. Thank y'all so much for watching.